Okay, I bought a new uh, a new ohm meter. This is a nice one, digital, and this is what I'm getting on the uh, green wire. Is the green wire? Yes, the green wire. And look, I can see. I think I believe I have it set up right. I'm at 200, so it should be showing that my ohm should be at 25 right now when it's sitting on the magnet. Uh, it goes back to. You'll see. It goes. Once it comes off, it goes to one. One is going to be my infinite because I took it off, and um, at one, that's infinite. So when I go hit the magnet, looking at about 1.79 after it settles, 1.8. This is on the green wire, which is going to be my PTO. Okay, I'll show you the other ones. I'm going to pause it. Pause it, yeah. Okay, here we have the blue wire, which is the CAN, C A N. And I got it closely set so you can see. I can do. There, sitting on it. You got 108.5 or so. That's again the blue wire, C A N. Okay, now we're set up on the, on the red wire. Let's see what we got here. Red wire is about 1.106 ohms. And this stuff is supposed to be at 25 ohms. So maybe someone can make sense of all this. Am I really way off? <laughs> if it's supposed to be 25 and I've got 106, like I said, I think I'm set up right. I've got it on the uh, 200. See that? I've got it on 200, which should give me the proper reading for 25. Um, again, let's see. Now I got it better. You can see when it's off, it's at one. And when I go on and touch it, the I'm at 106. Or so, and this is the red one. So they're all around this range. I'm gonna do a continuity test. The other wire, see what's going on, but it doesn't look good.